Okay. What is up, Aminettes? It's me, Amma Jane, on Amma Jane TV, and this is the last reaction of the day of 2019 that I didn't do, that I did not do. So, Kiana, the queen, has arrived. I already saw her king, Dawn. Now I'm going to see the queen, Kiana, with flower shower. Will she still be twerking? I don't even know. If she still is, fam, I live for her twerkings because, you know, even when she when she was in Cube, she still twerked. She still do her ting. She was quite controversial. People hated her. They hated the fact that they're not her. So, I love her for her being her. Her being an artiste. That's what artists do. It's their job. <laughs> to perform. They make money to perform. It's their job. It's their career. Just like you become a doctor, you becoming a fire fighter, you becoming a teacher, you becoming um, a manager in a very important factory of clothing, making clothes, I don't know. Or you working for Apple, the Apple house, I don't know. Or you cutting hair or grooming animals, whatever you do, or taking care of animals' health, you have a profession. So they do. So the, so has the people who are into acting, singing, musical theatre, modelling and dancing. So five things. This woman has worked really, really hard for so many years and people still hate her. Well, Something's wrong with you. So we are going to react to Hiana, Flower, Shower, and three, two, one, go, go. It's all her flowers. There's Hiana. There's all, oh, butterflies. I love the effect. Yeah. She's so gorgeous. Jesus, stunning. It looks so pretty. I love her hair. So pretty. Yes, that crown belongs to her, bitch. Oh, that dress? Royalty. What did I say? Royalty. This girl is royalty. I don't care what you hate her saying about her or the poppycocks that you're saying. I live for Hiana. Yes, Hiana. Yes, bitch. This is what I live for. She looks stunning. I love it. That dress is everything on her. It really looks good on her. I would look like, like crap, but she looks so pretty. So pretty. I love the dress that she's wearing. Looking at the, the, the yellow dress, it kind of reminds me of those dresses that would Latinas would wear in a telenovela. Yes, queen, work it. This, this queen is working every ounce of her. That dress is the ruffle dress. It's so colourful. I love this. I live for her hair. That hair is everything. If someone would cast her as the main a main lead lady in an Atene novela, she would be perfect. I live for this. So pretty. I love it. I'm loving, I'm loving the fact that she just proved everyone wrong. She still can make music while she's dating Dawn. And Dawn can still make music and making him successful while he's dating Kiana. They're paving the way, bitch. They're paving the way for more idols to not being scared of dating.
they paved the way because now, now, you, now you have Chen from EXO just coming up clean and saying, you know what, I'm dating, I'm going to get married, I'm going to be a father. Boom, 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 boom. Va, va, boom. She just looks va, va, boom. I just love it. So pretty. 10 out of 10. Do I need to explain what just happened in this music video? No, right? I have nothing to explain other than she looks stunning. She just, just ripped K-pop and said, I'm still here, bitch. <laughs> I'm still here. You can try every negativity about me just because I'm dating. Here I am. I'm still making music. I'm still, I'm here to stay. And don't, bitch, I may be dating, but I'm still here though. I'm still making music. Yeah, I ain't gonna do anything right now, so. <sighs> you know what? It makes me more happy in seeing K-pop idols get married, K-pop idols dating, K-pop idols becoming parents. Because at the end of the day, they're human beings. You got Momo and Hichu. Okay, people are, are complaining about the age gap. You guys need to remember, sometimes I have my sister, I have an older sister. Um, speaking of age gap, I want to <laughs> make sure you bitches are seated, seat, are well seated in your seats, like stuck onto you, like like super glue, just to just to make to shut down people who are being so negative about age gap and this and that. Sometimes you never know who's gonna be your you know your significant other that's going to be the one that you're going to stay with the rest of your life. And I know some people say, oh, I'm not going to let my daughter date this person because he's old. My sister, my older, one of my, my older siblings, my older sister, she, she's married to her husband, who's English, of course, my sister's Colombian. Um, she's married to an Englishman who is pretty much, not pretty much, exactly... 10 years older than her. 10 years! That's a massive age gap. That's a big age gap. But my sister didn't really look for his money. She wasn't looking for someone like, she said, my sister once said, don't fall in love with your heart, fall in love with your head. <laughs> so she was, she was very smart. She didn't care about his age. He didn't care how, how young she is. The fact was, there's love. And they have two beautiful daughters. <laughs> they have two beautiful daughters. It's just, yeah, it just happens. You just, it's sometimes, and, they, and they're still married and they're still, they're still happy. They're still content. It's, what I'm trying to say is, don't judge someone by, just by their age. Sometimes the age, sometimes love doesn't have rules that you have to fall in love in a certain age. My mom, I understand my mom is old school. And she she expects people to be either the same age or or a year or two years older or younger. But she's saying ten years is just a bit too much. But my sister is married to someone who's ten years. But sometimes love comes in so many different ways. You can't you shouldn't you shouldn't judge. And maybe Momo likes older men. And or maybe not, I don't know, because love is very, it comes in mysterious ways. It doesn't have, you fall in love with this person because he has been the same age as you. No. She fell in love with Hichu, probably his personality. You know what Hichu's like. Hichu, <laughs> I love Hichu's personality. Everyone loves Hichu's personality. And I think she fell in love not just because he's a good looking man. He, he's a still handsome man. He doesn't look like he's in his 30s. Let's, let's be real, guys. Just because he's in his, in his 30s and he's dating someone who's younger than him, it doesn't mean, it doesn't make him a creep. Love does, if that was the case, then I have to view my brother-in-law, who's older than my sister, 10 years, a creep. But he's not. He just loves her genuine, it was, it's genuine love. And you can tell with Momo and Hichu, it's genuine love. So, guys, stop judging, <laughs> please. Love doesn't, love has no rules. Love has no age limit. That's the thing. I don't want you guys to understand. Love comes in when you least expect it. And you never know who's, who's that person that's going to be the one. 
I don't know who's going to be the one. People keep asking me the same question over and over again. Who's your boyfriend? Do you have a boyfriend? When are you going to get married? I don't know. <laughs> Honestly, honest to God, I don't even know. I, I can't predict my future. And some people are dealing with someone who's older and younger and it's, sometimes it happens. It just happens to be that way. But anyways, guys, I hope the reflection is love is love. And I'm so glad that Hyona is still making music while she's dating Don. And Don is still making music while he dates Hyona. Power couple, guys. And you know what? It, their love, if you look at their Instagram, their love is so genuine. It's so cute. I just love it. I just live for every second of their post with their pets, with them just being going for a date, just them having a laugh, them just enjoying themselves, them dancing. Have you seen their dance choreographies before they even signed with P Nation? F fam. This, these two are no joke. They work together, they still, they love each other. Please get married. That's the first thing. Please get married. Please get married. Don't know when you're going to get married, but these these two has paved the way they literally completely broke barriers saying you know what we're tired because you know what k-pop idols if you realize most k-pop idols get married and they moved away from k-pop completely these two have not if you realize this these two have to be the very first k-pop idols k-pop idols to still continue to perform they are still continuing to perform while they're dating. If they eventually get married, they're still going to continue to perform. Guys, that is amazing. <laughs> this is great because they're not, they're not, if, are they going to retire? I don't think they're ever going to retire. And not because they're going to listen to some immature little fans who are upset and upping their feelings because they're dating. You don't own them. <laughs> You don't own them, so I'm I'm proud of them, and yeah, this is great. This is great. This this was a ten out of ten because the woman looked stunning. And if anyone is looking for a slightly Asian an Asian girl that has a very Latina, because I swear to God, she has some Latin American spirit in her somewhere, because her black hair, that long black hair, that yellow dress just screams a perfect Korean woman to be the uh, the leading lady for a telenovela, Latin American telenovela. She just looked perfect, the perfect one for that, for that role, whatever role that is, whoever is working for uh, stories for a telenovela, please cast a Korean girl, cast them. Don't just cast just some always Latina, Latina, cast Asian ones too. Because that way we can break some barriers. And we continue breaking barriers just like this. So with that being said, I love you all. Anyon everyone and Therahil. And yeah, I hope all these K-pop idols that are dating right now. I'm happy. <laughs> yes. And for those delusional my fans, just uh, move on and just 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 re just think of your life, please. Think of your life. Think, think, think about you, love yourself, and yeah, that's all. Love yourself, guys. And yeah.